Hello everybody. Welcome to Digital Painting and Photography channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful Little Island, Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer. I made this image a couple of days ago. Well, stream punk, another one. Okay, I got this image by being an image creator. These days, co-pilot design or something, yeah? Okay, I got this original AI generative image to expand to horizontal image. Then I changed colorized on Adobe Photoshop. Then bring to clear AI to get upscale. Then I get this. Well, from this to this. Okay. This is the base image today. Horizontal image, colorize some, correct? Then uh, change color back to this fashion from base image. But details, that's better with clear AI to upscale. Okay, now from here. I made line drawing type image with find edges on Adobe Photoshop. Change blend mode to pin light, half tone 50. Okay. Then duplicate expand image, change blend mode to color. Add over this half tone image. Nice color, settle. Then Duplicate this layer, change blend mode to overlay, add over this image to get some contrast. Well, so this base image to this. A little bit of contrast, lighten up, nice. But I want to add some colors though for background, pier, these buildings and stuff. So I'm going to add layer of all color okay add color to make it a little more colorful image okay like uh, this building here let's see choose the brush to airbrushing to soft brush just add color okay let me change the blend mode to color Okay, now touch, touch colorful background. Okay, now where else? Maybe ocean. Okay, then maybe sky area. Now I gotta duplicate this color layer. Then change blend mode to normal because I want to add color over the less density area. Okay, how's that? Pretty much. Okay, I guess overall is okay now. A little more colorful background. Okay, this is the base image. Okay, about this image now. Okay, make group. Yeah, make group, base group image. Okay, over this base group image, add layer for white layer. Fill this layer with white. Then duplicate this line drawing type image. Move this one up over white layer. Okay. Change blend mode to darken. Opacity up to maybe about 86, 7. Okay. Make mask on this white layer. Then 
let's see, change brush to drawing to evolve. Now brush size, a little bit big size, printing opacity to reveal this. Nice line drawing type image. Okay, make it a little bit small size, then pretty thick opacity. Okay, now leave it this right now and uh, add layer or gradation color layer. Okay, add layer, then add mask. Invert this mask. Okay, now open up some okay, colorful background. Yeah, okay, change the color to white. Okay, add color, change brush to soft brush. Now give it nice sky color is a little bit sunset color. She's got nice highlight from left side. Okay, let me fix this gradation color layer hole. Little window. Change brush to evolve. Okay, I'm gonna fix these masks. Go for white layer mask. Okay, I guess pretty much done. A little more darkened model space, I think. Yeah, okay, I guess that's it. Alright, let's see. From this base image, base group image, add white layer with mask then add line drawing type image then gradation color layer with mask touch yeah this time this image i kind of like shadow colors don't need to so much dark image this is yeah kind of interesting yeah if i can darken this Maybe duplicate this base group image. Make one layer, then add over this to darken. Let me see. Duplicate this, then flatten this image. Now we got the one base group image, right? Okay, just one layer. Then change blend mode to color burn. Tone down. About 50, 20. But no, no need to darken so much. Yeah, it doesn't make it, mm, that much difference. I kind of like just straight. I mean, without this add color. This is fine, I think. Alright, well. Thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate for you guys' support. 
and uh, I hope you're gonna find some idea for your creative work and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao and good day thank you